Their seventh year in a row at the Grand Prix oh Final. And they've been on the podium each of the last three years, including a victory back in 2015. Won their first Grand Prix assignment on the home ice earlier this year at Skate Canada. And were also third most recently at Skate America in Lake Placid. Triple twist to start things off. And there is a ton of firepower in this free program. And we will see how it goes with these next two elements really setting the tone for the rest of the program. The side by side triple Lutzes. Very well done. Much better than we saw in the short program. Quadruple Sal. Oh, the weight gets too far forward and she slips over the toe pick. Out, double toe. Megan only gets a single toe off. Lutz, beautiful landing. Lift up. Yeah. 
You can see the fatigue setting in late in the program, but the resilience to get things done, keeping them in the conversation. Now the veterans in their eighth season together. Changed coaches over the summer and coming into this Olympic campaign saying that they feel refreshed, rejuvenated, and hoping to make the Olympic podium in two months' time. They are two-time world champions, six-time Canadian champions, and a regular presence on the podium here at the Grand Prix Final. Starting this free program in fifth place, just over three points from a podium spot today. I really tried to get those toes done with myself. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> And you know, they've done a great job of putting themselves back into contention this season. They're two time world champions. They had that dominant season about two years ago. But last year, they just looked burnt out. They have so much technical content and they really rely on doing these clean programs with these difficult elements. Here, the throw, Quad Sal just gets a little forward as she comes out. You see the weight too far past the toe pick. The bite can't hold on. And when you make that mistake, it doesn't hurt you that much on a technical side because the starting value is so high anyway. You only lose four points from that starting value. So you still get quite a substantial score, but it really deflates the components. The energy in this program is so different when that throw quad hits or when it misses. And you could see the energy really coming out late in the program. That last lift went up so okay, crooked, Come and on, he's forced to take his time, get that elbow locked before he can start turning. Really just a break in the momentum. Could be in danger of breaking this streak of three consecutive podiums at the Grand Prix Final. They are in first place at the moment, halfway through this final field. 210-83, their total score. And their total score is 210.83.